A logo is displayed, depicting six blind cane-holding figures, arranged in a pinwheel pattern in the colors of orange, blue, and green. They sit atop the words, National Federation of the Blind of Nebraska. Live the life you want. Hi, it's Amy Burrish. Faith, family, friendship, and football are all things that come to mind when I think about the National Federation of the Blind of Nebraska. Faith, of course, because um, it's through the Federation philosophy and the loving support that I have found within the Federation, um, I believe in myself and I believe in the abilities of all blind people to find their way to live independently the lives that they want. And family, because that's very much how we interact with one another, especially here in Nebraska and I know definitely all across the nation. And it's a special gift, there's no doubt about it. And then my family. I, because of the Federation, have an incredible husband and the greatest kids on the planet. And I'm very blessed for that and have the Federation to thank. And have made some of the very best friends ever through my work in the Federation. And football, because it never fails that on <laughs> any convention Saturday uh, in the fall, there is bound to be a football game happening between the Huskers and whatever team. And it remains to be true this year in our golden anniversary that the day the Big Ten chose to come back <laughs> during the pandemic was our convention Saturday. And hopefully we give the Buckeyes a a good run for their money. I'm sure many of us in Lincoln will never forget that fateful Saturday when Matt Davison made the catch <laughs> and we were driving from Lincoln to Omaha to attend the White Cane Banquet and I didn't think the van was going to stay on the road. I mean we were jumping around, we had the radio at its maximum volume and um, <laughs> we're just having a great time but what a game and what a great group of people. And there's no better place to be. Hello, my fellow Federationists. This is Shane Burrish. Wow, 50 years. And to think, I've been around for more than half of it. What are the golden nuggets I've taken from being an NFBN? Well, it's genuineness, truth, and knowing that someone will let me be myself. From the time I met this outfit in 1992, I knew that I'd found a family and a home because the folks here did things and said things that I knew were the truth about blindness but had never found the words to express. They took me in and gave me opportunities that I can never repay. What other group would let me make skits with my friends, take me on outings through the halls of Congress for advocacy and making change? What other group would tolerate a guy being in full Cookie Monster costume for an entire evening singing the Monster Mash? Every day I pray that you all know that I would do anything to help you or help elevate the lives of the blind. Perhaps that pie in the face a couple conventions ago might have started to prove that. Anyhow, I thank you from the bottom of my heart for including me in NFBN and for helping me live the life I want. The preceding presentation was brought to you by the National Federation of the Blind of Nebraska. Live the life you want.